Well, I'm, I'm surprised that this is still happening because we have gone through this in the past. It is very clear that the kind of returns that are being offered are clearly not sustainable. We went through it in the days of the finance houses when they were offering very fantastic returns. We went through it in the days of the Umana Umana and so many other, other schemes like that. Then we had the, the Nospect, Nospecto experience and all of that. Those things, are, they are just like a bubble. At some point, the bubble will burst and the people naturally will burn their fingers. So it is something that is not sustainable. It's something that cannot last. So I'm not surprised that they are not beginning to do some rescheduling of payment and so on and so forth. So anybody that is part of that scheme must be somebody that has failed to learn from the experience of the past. No, 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 no. It's, it's a wrong way to, it's, it's an illusion. It's a wrong way to seek an exit from, from recession because it's not something that will provide an enduring solution to recession. Some people will benefit those who are, you know, in and quickly get out of it. But ultimately, some people will have to pay for it and they pay dearly. So it's clearly something, it's a scheme that is not sustainable. So I'm surprised that even people are supposed to be enlightened, people are supposed to have very sound level of financial literacy are also part of this scheme. So I think it's a question of, you know, sometimes you could see that people are driven by greed or something. That is what can, you know, expose you to that kind of, uh, that kind of thing. I don't know what kind of licensing these, these operators have, you know? If they, if they are duly registered, but what is more important is the judgment and the discernment on the part of those who are putting their money there. I think that is what, what is more important. When something is too good, you have to be very cautious, you have to be very careful. Those returns are too good to be sustainable. So the blame will be more on those who are falling victims, especially when we had the benefits of history. This thing has happened some 10 years ago. It has happened some five years ago. It has happened some 20 years ago. Why must anybody fall a victim of that at this time? 